me dio la pauta para saber qué es lo que tengo que hacer en esta y pues obviamente más que hacer algo diferente tengo que adaptarle a lo que hice, ¿no? Tengo que adaptar eh, mi manera de, de tirar más golpes, de estar más constante en los rounds, tirando golpes, tirando golpes, creo que vamos a trabajar mucho en la condición física, eso es lo que, lo que nos falta un poco en la, en la pelea pasada, aunque llevamos mucha, yo creo que nos hace falta un poco más para estar constante tirando golpes. They were claiming him as a monster, middleweight monster, you know, you know spirit man in the middleweight division. Did is he everything you expected it to be? No, yo, yo, yo sé lo que era, yo sé lo que él era desde el principio, ¿no? Él ya está adaptado a las 160 libras desde hace pues, prácticamente toda su carrera, ¿no? Yo siempre dije que cuando subiera a las 160 iba a enfrentar al mejor, se supone que él es el mejor, y lo enfrentamos y la verdad que me sentí muy bien, me sentí muy bien, no, no es su pegada, no es uh, fuera nada del otro mundo, así que me sentí bien, soy un peleador fuerte también y como te digo, yo creo que la primera pelea me dio la pauta para en esta pelea saber qué es lo que tengo que hacer para ganar convincentemente, ¿no? que aunque sigo pensando que gané la pelea pasada, eh, eh, como sea, ¿no? tengo que hacer algo diferente en esta pelea para ganar convincentemente. No, yo sabía, yo sabía que él es un peleador que aguanta muchos golpes, es un peleador que aguanta muchos golpes y sobre todo arriba, no, arriba él aguanta muchísimos golpes y yo sabía, eh, simplemente seguir mi, mi pelea, no, es, es un golpe más, un golpe más, sabía que él es un peleador fuerte y que aguanta golpes. Sí, no, la verdad que ese golpe era para, era, es un golpe para... I don't know what Canelo just said, ladies and gentlemen. I just delivered the news in a very subjective, sometimes objective way, depending on how you see it. That is Canelo. Shout out to Fight Hype. Uh, please subscribe to Fight Hype TV while you're subscribing. Subscribe to my channel, Live Wire. We're live. Um, first question. Why is the dude asking these questions in in English and answering? Let me let me rephrase that. Why is this dude asking questions in English and then answering or taking answers from Canelo in Spanish? That makes no sense. No sense whatsoever. Whoever thought of this, I don't know, man. I, I think you might need to rethink certain things in life. Um. Secondly, why is Canelo commenting on um, Triple G's performance? Look, man, I know what the, I know what the official scorecard said. I know what the decision was. It was a draw. Every single boxing fan I know has said the following: Canelo lost that fight. He lost it. He didn't look good towards the end. Look. It was a clear decision to Triple G, right? I don't think if you lost a fight like that, in which you are known as a knockout artist, along with the other guy, you should be saying things like his power is a 9 out of 10. You don't know what his power is like. What if he was also holding back? If you were holding back, which it sounds like you were. And let's not forget, man. Despite what the scorecard said, Canelo, you lost, brother man. You really lost. He beat you. You have to regain whatever Canelo energy you lost from that fight. If you don't, he's going to beat you even more decidedly again. So, um, decisively. My bad. Let me know what you guys think. Like, comment, subscribe, and I am out. And I beat you. And I lost respect for you when you say you about this culture and this music, because you ain't. The day you feel you can question me, being where you're from, Chevy Chase, Maryland, graduated in 98, you ain't got no word in this city, it's my city. <laughs> Any of you radio personalities think you want smoke? Call me Mr. Chimney. I want smoke. You know why? Because you can never, you don't work hard as me, bro. You're a sidekick.
sidekick in this city. Sidekick in the morning. Sidekick on your own show. On Complex, you look like a sidekick. Tell Complex to cut me a check tomorrow. Because I made you mad at a night. I'm going to get you some numbers that show is trash on Complex. You're about the culture, but you bring up that ding dong chick to interview. Who you think? We stupid? You think I'm stupid? 